Okay guys, so today I have my Bath and Body Works, well actually round two Bath and Body Works white burn haul for you. So um, yeah, here's my, my bag from Bath and Body Works and here is my bag from the white burn. So um, yeah, if you want to see what I got, just keep watching. Each Bellini. Like, I didn't see this the first time I went in there. Um, but I picked this up. It smells really good. And I don't really like that peach Bellini candle. It was like one of the first candles that I purchased from Bath & Body Works. And I didn't get a good burn on it. So, it's not one of my favorite scents. But this smells really good. I'm not a real big peach girl either though. But, this smells good. And I can, I can get into this one. So I'm, I gave this a shot. Self up the mango mandarin, and I got I, I got this before, but I picked myself up an, another one and also the set of three. Now I like the scent enough to where I wanted to actually smell it in the shower. I don't believe that these actually, you know, help the scent last any longer or whatever. But I actually. Do like this scent. So I found some 75% off candles, and you know I just couldn't let that pass by without you know at least looking at them, cause you know I thought they would all be gone by now, but apparently they're putting them out still. Um, my theory behind this is I think that they choose the area that they're going to stock with 75% off candles, and then they don't put them in any other stores because I've been hearing you know on social social media that other people aren't getting any and I I am usually one of those people because we I've never seen them before but this year for some reason my store has a plethora of 75% off candles and they just keep coming so um like every day so um I actually found some mason jars this time around and they were 75% off so I picked up watermelon lemonade and this is in the pretty bubble packaging I don't know I guess milk glass packaging and I like this scent it's uh it's really good it's really true to a watermelon what a watermelon lemonade would smell like it is uh not one of my absolute favorites for summertime but I do like the scent so and these were two dollars and two dollars and seventy six cents for watermelon lemonade. I got four of them. Like I said, one, two, three, woo, four. So there's four of those. And um, they didn't really have uh, too many great scents. They had a lot of uh, sweet cinnamon pumpkin. They had a lot of those, which I didn't need any more of that. Um, and I also picked up this, which I have never smelled before and didn't even know about it. It's the Cherry Blossom Sangria. And, oh man, if you, this, oh my God, this smells so good. It smells, I don't know what a Cherry Blossom Sangria smells like, but I wish they had more of these. They only had three, so I picked up the three that they had. But, oh my God, this one, one, two three and for two dollars and seventy cents or seventy six cents under three dollars girl one of my favorites and this is the vanilla this is the vanilla pumpkin marshmallow and this is good this is this is just good I think people have been saying that this is similar to um, vanilla marshmallow or something or marshmallow vanilla candle but I've never had that one so I don't know um, this is really a good candle, and I'm, I was so happy to find one lonely mason jar in the fragrance. So this is gonna be this is love. And um, I found a couple of uh, room sprays also, and I found the spice apple toddy. And to me, this smells exactly like leaves. So of course I love leaves, and of course I had to pick this up. I'm a, I'm pretty big on apple scents, so I, I I picked I scooped it up. And um, the next one is the Cinnamon Caramel Swirl. And, you know, what can I say? I just, I think it's a good fragrance. And I'll save it till Christmas time. Or actually, 
I could probably get away with using this at Halloween time. It is, it's good. And I needed to get up to $40 to use my uh, 10 off 30 coupon. So I picked up this one. Now these were only half off today, which I mean, yeah. So that made them 11 eleven dollars and um twenty five cents and this was per the salesperson's recommendation i've never burned this one um nor did i have any interest in it but i wanted to give it a try and so yeah i got it because i didn't see any more little ones that i wanted so yeah i didn't want to just be getting stuff just because it was on sale so but this it's not bad. It is a little bit out of my comfort zone. It's uh, I don't know. I'll have to I'll have to see about this. This it it may be a keeper. We'll see. But I do like the um pear riesling. Now that one is good. But I do have a couple of those, and I didn't I didn't want to get any more. So we'll give this one a try. This uh Sundrance Vineyard, and um, see how that goes. So, but I am so excited about these, and you know what, guys. I, I have picked up so many candles this is my annual sale. I just wanted to stop right now because I don't need any more candles. So this needs to this needs to stop. But um, I I'm having so much fun and um, I do love to burn candles. So I'm not complaining. So <laughs> and they're cheap right now. So yeah. But uh, anyway, so have you been finding any 75% any off candles at your White Barn or Bath and Body Works? What do you think about my theory? You guys think that they just purposely put them at certain areas in the country and then just like leave out other people so that they can't get any? So um, I don't know. I don't know why they do that or what's the rhyme or reason behind it. But yeah, this, this in my annual sale to me has been the best in my annual sale season that I can remember because I've been getting so many wonderful sales and deals i really hope that you guys are having great luck also and i will see you in the next video don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and yeah bye guys